Castle Rock Farm and Homestead. Um, here we got some hay. So with the sheep and the goats, we got to get a little bit more of this this year. Um, last year I only went through maybe, I don't know, eight bales or so over the winter with the two goats. Now we got six total, so got 30 bales here. I'm hoping that's going to be enough to get us through. We'll find out. Um, but yeah, we got to get this moved and get this stored. So take you through that process. Maybe it's not the most exciting video, but it's what we're doing. So come along and join us as we get this hay put up. So where are we going to put 30 bales of hay? That's what I asked myself. Um, it's going to go in the rabbit shed here. So this isn't something we've featured a whole heck of a lot on the channel. I've seen it a couple times. You'll notice we've got a whole hutch missing, a whole rabbit missing. Um, Bun Bun, our Flemish giant, went to a good home. An uh, older gentleman that breeds them. Um, took them there. To, she was a pet. She wasn't serving any purpose because they didn't really do anything with her. So went to a better home. Um, freed up some room. So we're going to use this half of the rabbit shed as hay storage. Hopefully I'll be able to get all of it in here. Um, pretty much I think I will. But first we got to get some pallets down on the ground. We don't want to put it directly on the ground. So I'll grab the tractor, fire it up and Got some pallets I just picked up along the way. We'll get them in here and start stacking. All right, not really sure what size we're going to need, so we brought an assortment of sizes here. So let's get these in here and get stacking some hay bales. Big ones fit about perfectly with space I'm going to need, um, so we're going to go with those. Probably get two of them in here. Might have a little space in the middle. I got a piece I might be able to make that up with. There's the cobwebs. See, maybe we can do two this way. Not quite, but I think that extra piece I have is going to fit perfectly there. Got this old ladder from a kid's swing set thing that somebody's getting rid of. Um, pour it down and use it for some stuff so I think it'll fit perfect yep so got our nice floor in there now so we can start stacking the bales and keep them nice and dry over the winter what we got here is we got one leftover pallet I'm going to use that to stack the bales on bring them on over and start stacking them in the shed and see see if we can get all 30 of them in here hopefully we can
go. We got 28 bales in there. Got two left over on the tractor here. Um, they'll fit on the shelf in the little feed shed I got here. And I got two old bales left over from last year. We'll find a spot for them. Feed those first this year. Um, but yeah, got our hay up. That's a ton of hay. And if you do the math, it's about literally a ton of hay. I'd say these bales averaged out to 55, 60 pounds a bale. Um, the math that's almost a ton so yeah i'm pooped that was a lot to do today um but yeah we should be good to go for the winter i hope that's gonna last all six of them the whole way through if not i'll be hunting down some more and maybe you'll join me for that I'm trying to find hay in the middle of january or something i don't know but here we go i uh, appreciate you joining me this one's a little different just doing a mundane task here on the farm Thanks for joining me. I hope you like and subscribe. Keep keep growing the channel.